If you're travelling with a van or motorhome, you're going to need a base from which to explore, and I think I've found the perfect spot. The Toowoomba showgrounds are huge, and regularly hold equestrian and other agricultural events. When they're not, the council throws open the gates to travellers looking for a short stay. Karen was telling me that the Toowoomba Showgrounds is in fact the largest showground in the country. Is that right? That's what I've told. That's what that's I was told. True. That's is that true? Absolutely true. I learned that little fact last and time I was here. That's a good thing because there are a thousand people here. <laughs> a thousand. <laughs> Tell you what, people are travelling in their vans at the moment. Thanks very much. Look, there you go. All even, good. Even get a party hat when you arrive. It's fantastic. <laughs> 25 bucks gets you power and water for four and you can park wherever you like amongst the heritage buildings, show rings and cattle yards. Well they say that one man's trash is another man's treasure. Well, at a lot of these caravan parks you'll find these little sort of spots where people leave the bits and pieces they don't want anymore and it's for free to help yourself and you never know what you might find. And on the way out, there's a new salute to some old engineering and tech. This is the interesting thing about the windmill. The country would not have been opened up the way it was without this piece of equipment because of course, you know, we have the great artesian basin underneath, very dry continent. And the windmill was used to get water to the service so we could uh, put cattle across the land. So that, it really helped to open up Australia.